I slayed this album was kind of a nightmare to deal with, but in the best way possible. I thought that I was so ready. Um, like two years ago, I thought I was ready. I had collected all of these sessions and don't even, beautiful sessions and don't even remember half of them because it, it evolved each year. And then something would happen to me and it would be very drastic so that it would take me somewhere else. And then all of a sudden I found this healing and I saw something bigger than what I thought that I was. And I think that also added the whole end of the album. So I heard Rare uh, a few years ago and I felt... I just felt like that was me, if that makes sense. Um, obviously, I've had a lot of uh, self-esteem issues in the past. I still struggle with confidence, and, you know, it's it's going to be something that I'll always be working on. Um, and I just... Um, and so Rare made me feel incredible, and I ended up cutting the record before all the other stuff came together and I never let go of that that name was so important to me the moment I heard it I said that's the name of my album because I I that to me is such a special word and if there's anything that I could do for women even and men it would be to tell them that that they're valued and that they're rare and that they're important. Uh, that's what it means to me. And then I guess I'll never forget my session with Scott Kid Cuddy, uh, because he, obviously I'm a huge fan, but he definitely took the song that I had and turned it into something unbelievable. It was nothing when I had sent him the song. Actually, technically, someone sent it without my permission at first because I was scared, but it's okay. It worked out. Um, and 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 he just, I said, I, pure, I purely trust you with this, and I think that was super exciting for him. And I don't know. We had the best time, like the best conversations, just music, how he approaches it. I, I felt very honored to have him on the album and he's a really nice guy I love 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 my fans very much um, and I think it's not that I love them because they love me I love them because or you if you're watching it uh, because it's really been about the journey and I feel like I grew up with a lot of people and the the most heartbreaking conversations are where they're just telling me that they're suffering or you know it's some of it's like you know been been I just don't I never understood it when people would say it saved my life I just didn't understand that and I always just like I wish I could just grab every single one of them in their face and just tell them how loved they are how important they are how they're capable of absolutely anything. And if I did all of this, and I'm just a girl from Texas, and it's still happening for me, you could do anything. And I've had a lot of moments where people were not having it. And, you know, they build you up to, to just break you down. But I would just say that that, I would say that you're beautiful and that you're exactly where you're meant to be, whatever that looks like. Even if it's so hard, you're, you're, worth, you're worth it. And you always have to choose yourself. Um, and I love them very much.